Unmanned helicopters are proving essential in modern military and civilian operations, delivering critical capabilities in surveillance, logistics, reconnaissance, and even armed missions. With their ability to operate in challenging environments and execute tasks without risking human lives, demand for these versatile systems is rapidly growing. In this evolving landscape, EDGE, a defense conglomerate based in the United Arab Emirates, acquired a majority shareholding in Anavia, a Swiss developer of vertical takeoff and landing systems, in late 2023. Following this acquisition, the company secured a contract to supply 200 unmanned helicopters to the UAE Ministry of Defense. This agreement marks the UAE's largest procurement of unmanned helicopter systems to date, aimed at bolstering the country's VTOL capabilities. So, in this video, let's take a closer look at the specifications, capabilities, and applications of the HT-100 unmanned helicopter. The HT-100 unmanned helicopter, officially designated as Multi-Role Rotary Wing Unmanned Aerial Vehicle, is designed for both military and civilian applications, offering enhanced capabilities for surveillance, reconnaissance, and logistics. This multi-role platform weighs just 55 kilograms and can efficiently cover extensive areas with a maximum range of 600 kilometers and a top speed of 120 kilometers per hour. One of the standout features of the HT-100 is its rapid deployment capability, allowing the helicopter to be prepared for flight in just 15 minutes. This quick readiness is crucial for operations that require agility and swift responses, contributing to its overall efficiency in various mission scenarios. Once airborne, the HT-100 has a flight endurance of up to six hours, enabling comprehensive intelligence gathering or payload delivery during its missions. What's more, the HT-100 is not subject to international traffic in arms regulations restrictions, which expands its operational flexibility across various regions. According to the manufacturer, the HT-100 is equipped with a state-of-the-art avionics suite, a fully encrypted mesh IP data link for secure communications, capable of operating through LTE and SATCOM. With a communication range of 200 kilometers, operators can maintain contact even at significant distances. Safety seems to be a top priority in the design of the HT-100. It features an advanced automatic flight control system that ensures a fully autonomous return to base in the event of lost radio contact. This capability is complemented by flight control redundancy with four actuators, enhancing reliability during critical missions. The HT-100 is powered by a 15-kilowatt shaft turbine that minimizes vibrations while airborne. The integration of a Flettner double rotor system enhances stability and allows the helicopter to manage higher payloads effectively. In emergencies, it can engage an electric drive as a backup system and it is programmed for auto-rotation in case of an RPM drop. Operationally, the HT-100 is particularly effective for aerial inspections, border surveillance, and traffic monitoring, making it a valuable tool for law enforcement and civil defense. In military contexts, it can support communications intelligence, artillery coordination, and naval operations, contributing to enhanced situational awareness on the battlefield. The HT-100 also facilitates logistics operations through its custom cargo box and remote drop capabilities. It can carry a 65-kilogram payload, making it suitable for delivering critical supplies, including medical provisions, to remote locations. This ensures timely support where it is needed most. Safety features such as an automatically deployable parachute system minimize risks during emergency landings, further enhancing its operational reliability. The agreement between EDGE and the UAE Ministry of Defense was officially announced at the Unmanned Systems Exhibition and Conference, UMEX, in Abu Dhabi, and includes the supply of 200 unmanned helicopters, comprising the HT-100, but also a larger model known as the HT-750. While the HT-100 has been detailed extensively, 
the HT750 is expected to be a heavier lift version designed to carry larger payloads, though no official images have been released yet. More details will likely emerge as production moves forward. So, what are your thoughts on how these unmanned helicopters might shape future military operations? Let us know in the comments. And if you found this video informative, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more updates on defense technology.